what is up you guys it is your boy diamonds here at common sense graphics and today in this video you already know what it be it is any monday and i'm about to freeze you all in place with today's anime art i did today today i am drawing itachi from naruto shippuden a very well-known character and very fun character to draw and i cannot tell you enough how much fun i had drawing this character and before i get started a little disclaimer uh, i only drew his head and i drew a very popular scene i'm gonna have the reference on the side and yeah, it's just a really cool image, but let's jump right into it. My experiences while creating this image was very simple and easy. It's fan art. Um, I said this in my previous video when I did Haruko from FLCO, that fan art is very easy. And it's anime. Anime is very easy, except for the eyes for me. For some reason, I can't draw eyes very well. But if I have a really good reference, then I can draw it. As you see here, the character is coming along. And in my experience of drawing this character, it was very simple and very fast and very easy. Um, Itachi has a very straightforward face and he's not hard to draw. He has uh, very jagged eyes, which was very simple. And I was just able to just bang him out without much issue. Uh, I did have a little bit of issue with drawing his outfit. And that's where I decided to just say I'm not going to draw his full body. I'm just going to draw him by like from the top of the head down to maybe like where his breasts would start out at the top of his torso and for my references i had two really good ones for this image i mean i've watched pretty much i'm still, I'm still actually for current on naruto and i've watched it all from beginning till now to boruto and so i have a very good gear of what itachi looks like he's actually like i said earlier a very easy person to draw his hair isn't too wild and it's just very straightforward and finding a good reference was not hard at all um, I used two different references I found on Google and they were really easy to, to rip straight from the anime and it made things very simple. Um, pretty much just started to add more detail on my own aspect and I just had a lot of fun with it and things came together very well for me as I was creating it as I was doing just the basic sketch before I went to the detail phase and I had a really good grip of what the character was doing and also a little disclaimer too I used the color palette from the resources I had I took the colors from the resources and I used it on this character just to save myself some time and it came out very nicely as a little cheating if you will but uh, that's just what it was and I had a lot of fun while creating this character and this would not be my first time drawing a Naruto character or not Naruto style character uh, if you guys seen any of my videos and you guys would know that I actually drew myself in a Naruto form as a Katsuki member with uh, myself having Itachi's Sharingan and the Six Paths the Renegon and it was really cool if you guys want to watch that I'll link it down below in the description and while making that I really did enjoy that process too it was completely freehand except for my face and the hand I needed help um, drawing the hand so I actually just found a stock image and traced the hand because I didn't know how to draw it and it's all in the video and you can see my process and it was really cool but um, I guess I could talk about some negatives that I had with this image probably my biggest negative like I said earlier was the clothing just because I didn't know what I wanted to do and my experiences with drawing clothing sometimes like clothing that's really baggy uh, overflowing you know things that's just laying over you for example the Akatsuki uniform is kind of just like a, a big humongous bathrobe that's just over them and I had a little bit of issue while doing that um, drawing that just because I wasn't sure what to do but um, I just had fun with it I just kept on plugging away and eventually you can see as things are coming together right now that I had a pretty good idea of what I wanted to do and using the reference really did help out for drawing the face and I just added my own little twist to it just to add more detail. I gave a more sharper look than the reference I had um, just because I thought it would be better for me to use a more sharper look. Uh, that's just my style when I'm drawing anime. Um, I try to make it my own in its own fashion. I don't try making a carbon copy just because then it's not fair on me or you guys. And uh, this one really did come out real nicely. And near the end of the video, I decided to make this into a, like a sticker like I did with my uh, FLCO one where I made it into like a cool looking sticker thing with the Horizon Sun. But in this, this case, I used the uh, Itachi Clan logo and um, Itachi Clan, the Chiha Clan logo. And I made it something really cool and really awesome. And I really did enjoy, look, I really did like the final outcome of the image. But um, we are now coming to a closer of the detail and sketching and stuff phases and uh, I really hope you guys enjoy 
enjoyed this video. Um, I'm going to speed it up here in a second like I usually do when it comes to the line arts, uh, color and gradients and things like that in background. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like again, um, please hit that subscribe button, like the video, hit the bell icon to be notified for my next upload. But this is Annie Monday. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching Common Sense. Your boy out.